you can see this is my uh, supply of uh, <laughs> face mask and uh, she'll last me a year I think perhaps oh well, this is not my bedroom but I'm just gonna lay down here crash here for a little bit and there's a lot of things that I want to talk about but um I guess one of the things that are one of the things that is on my mind is my mother. You know, like, she's still in the hospital and uh, it's really taken a long time. It's been almost like a month and, and a half. And uh, it'll be two months. The 25th will be two months. So hopefully she she won't be there until the 25th. I'm praying that she's going to get out soon. But, you know, she's still not well. So I'm just hoping that she will get better soon. And it's, just, it's been so difficult. There's a lot on my mind. And uh, you know, it's just there's not much I can do about it because... She's there and, uh, I don't know, she just, she calls me every day or I call her and she seems upset and I can't go visit her because they don't allow it. They don't allow visitors and, uh, she, um, you know, she's telling me she doesn't have, like, enough clothes and things like that, but... I'm going to see if I can talk to them. Maybe I can drop some things off. You know, she just basically has the hospital clothes. And I don't think she wants to be in those all the time. But I don't know. I have to talk with the nurse and see what she says. Um, you know, when you have a family member in the hospital for, for a long time. it's It's just very difficult. You know, it's like I feel hopeless sometimes because every time I talk to her and I see that, you know, I talk to her and she's not well and she's worried and upset, it really breaks my heart. It really does. You know, like I wish I could fix it all. I wish I could make her better, but really nothing I can do about it because it's not up to me, you know. The doctors are like doing their best, you know, taking care of her. So, hopefully soon, you know, she can she can come home and you know she can have a normal life. And you know, it's just hard for her because I know she's not. You know, it's just been so many years. She's never been like truly happy and I see that and I would like to change up I would like to change that but I don't know like I try to do things for her make her happy but she's just really depressed and uh, when somebody is like that it's not a lot you can do but we'll, we'll see we'll see what happens and I'm hopeful you know, in some ways, I guess I'm hopeful. Because I go back and forth, like I lose hope and then I'm hopeful again. Because I guess that's the only thing that could keep a person going, you know, having hope. It's just a difficult situation, you know. Just please keep her in your prayers. I really appreciate that.